Hello, this is Laptop Media, and today, we will show you how to open the Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Fold and what's inside of it. When we first tried to take the laptop apart we thought that Lenovo was forward-thinking enough, leaving an M.2 drive-sized cap behind the stand. However, when we removed the screws we were disappointed to see that it only hides a couple of connectors. So, because we didn't want to destroy the sample, we found a video from our colleagues at Lenovo, which demonstrates perfectly how to get inside of the ThinkPad X1 Fold. Please remember, it would be of great help to us if you just hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. That would motivate us to make even more and better videos for you. The first thing you need to do is to take the SIM card tray out with a sharp object like a needle. Then, remove some double-sided tape. There are four strips, that each has pull tabs for easy removal. Keep in mind that it's most likely that you need to supply yourself with spare ones before starting the process. In order to remove them, press inward the folio towards the center and start pulling the tabs. After that, flip the cover and undo the four screws. Then, push the folio out of the machine. The next step requires all eight screws that hold the stand to be removed. Then, Take out the five strips of double-sided tape that keep the glass attached. Only then, you have to remove the two screws from the so-called access door, we removed initially, and take it out as well. And now, you can remove all 13 screws that are holding the chassis, and then take the 9 smaller ones, as well. The next thing you need to do is to remove a single screw from the support bracket and lift it away. After that, you can unplug the touch LED cable beneath it, as well as the USB cable connector on its left. Then, disconnect all of the plugs you saw beneath the access door. Before you lift the board assembly away, take two of the 13 screws you previously removed and install it at the two places marked with an X.
This is when you can finally take the motherboard assembly out of the device. Keep in mind that you should try to avoid bending it backwards. As we saw on the Huawei MateBook X Pro, you need to remove the heat spreader before you reach the M.2 PCIe X4 drive. To do so, follow the numeric pattern undoing one screw at a time. And after you lift the heat spreader away, you can see the SSD drive and the WWAN card. By the way, we noticed that Lenovo is using a thermal pad, instead of thermal paste for their CPU, which may result in inefficient cooling, although the processor has a TDP of only 7 watts. Also, the fan here is extremely tiny. If you'd like to see more disassembly videos of the latest notebooks we would highly appreciate if you hit the like button and subscribe to the channel.